Hey, hey, what do you say? This is Pteranodon Media Show and Tell What the Hell. We're not doing a toy today. We are not doing a action figure today. We're doing something a little different. But we've, I think we've kind of done it before. But I usually get a bunch of toys, so I'm, I don't mind not showing toys. It's just that I've just been buying a lot of fucking toys recently. So, recently. All the fucking time. So, I got a package, and I know where it comes from. I do know where it comes from. Um, it comes from California. Yeah, yeah. No, this comes from Mr. Uh, Charles Band himself. Charlie Band personally packed this uh, box for me. No, he did not. But if you know who Charlie Band is, he is the main head honcho over at Full Moon. And what is Full Moon? Full Moon? How dare you? You don't know what Full Moon is? Well, Full Moon is a company that makes... Uh, a lot of movies. They make a lot of horror movies. But um, they um, are known mostly for the the Puppet Master movies. And uh, But they have, you know, some movies are very hit or miss. Uh, I happen to enjoy schlock movies. And it came in this nice box. I do think that I have another box on the way. Because if I remember correctly, I should have gotten this. Uh now, if you want to take a look, here is some really nice um, wrapping paper or stuffing paper. Really nice. Hope it does not have the coronavirus, and that's going to sound dated. Um, and it's like, what's in the box? All right, we're going to turn it over, and we're going to see now. I do have, let's see. Well, let's see. Where is my print? It's not in here. So... Video evidence. They didn't put it in here. Now, this took a while to get. That's one thing about Full Moon. No, but I got a... It was a Blu-ray special that they had. It was a buy one, get one free. And, the, and they were already at 50% off. And I thought it was a good deal. It was on um, Valentine's Day. So, yes. It was around that time. Uh, let's talk about Sorority Babes in the Slime Bowl Orama, which I am somewhat familiar with. I remember these crazy creatures. I've seen this movie once. Back in the day, we used to just rent a bunch of movies at the Blockbuster or at your local mom and pop shop. And you'd find crazy stuff like this. And you say, hey, is there a titty in there? Uh, creatures and titties were awesome when you were 12 years old. When did this come out? This was, um, I know this has Linnea Quigley in there because uh, anytime I'd see that on the back of a box, I'd say, ooh, I'm going to get this. 1988. So, yeah. I didn't watch it in 1988. I probably watched it around like maybe 1992 or something. Now, here's one I'm more so familiar with. Dr. Mordred. Yes, very good DVD. Uh, well, very good movie, in my opinion. This was actually supposed to be, and this is with Jeffrey Combs over here. Look at that handsome fella. Uh, you may know him from Reanimator. And um, and it's also the guy that played Shao Kahn. What's his name? <laughs> I love that guy. Uh, he, he was also in X-Files. I just love him. He's just a fantastic actor. And now, uh, what is it? Um, um, Fright Night 2. Yeah, so uh, Dr. Mordred originally was going to be a Doctor Strange movie. And uh, when, I guess, the license expired or something happened or another, um, they just decided to keep on making the movie and renaming it. So, yes, and it's been remastered in high-definition Blu-ray. And, yes, Tourist Trap. Yes, fun little slasher over here. Um, I've I've skimmed through this movie one point or another. I do remember the freaky masks um, in this movie, and um, that's good old Chuck Connors. He's come out in a bunch of westerns too. I have a few westerns with Chuck uh, Chuck Nor with Chuck Norris. Chuck Norris in a western. Chuck Connors in some um, Italian westerns that I have. Slave Girls from Beyond Infinity. Another one of those. Felt like those action uh, pay-per-views, um, and I believe, uh, was it, um, Brink Stevens was in this one here. And I did uh, see this. Now, this one I have not seen, Girls of the Golden Saloon. This uh, just looked like a movie I wanted to check out, because it has some Western elements with a bit of a sleaze. Yes, and it has Sandra, Julian, Evelyn Scott, and Alice Arno. I got this for about three bucks. Yeah, so we'll find out. Oh, yep, there's no nudity on this, so don't worry, YouTube. Mad Foxes and Rolls Royce Beauty. Yes. Um, I had these, I downloaded both of these. No, actually, I have not seen Mad Foxes. This is very, uh, very interesting. Um, and who directed it? It was, it was um, 
Uh, I'm not going to pretend to know this. Paul Grau. Yeah. And uh, it seemed very interesting. I look forward to discovering this. Um, has some uh, post-apocalyptic biker looking things going on. Some sleazy bondage S&M. You see a car running over someone and you see their hands sticking out. And... Um, yeah, very interesting. Now, Rolls Royce Baby, I have seen, and ooh, this is, as it says, it's decadent and elegant. Beautifully shot. Um, and um, who directed it? Jesus Christ. Dietrich. Yeah, Dietrich does some very beautiful uh, erotic films. So, But we are missing the other things. We're going to find out what we get now. If you'd like to see me do reviews on any of this, let me know. Let me know because um, I'd like to share some thoughts on this, some private thoughts. So we're going to put them all out here. Um, I'm very excited to check out Dr. Mordred again on Blu-ray because um, we're just going to find out how awesome it's going to end up looking because I have it on VHS somewhere. Dr. Mordred. Makes me feel like watching wax work, too. Anyway, folks, this is a, a, a full moon edition of Show and Tell What the Hell. Thank you to Charlie Band for sending this over very slowly. But, hey, I still need some of my other stuff here. What do I need? I got a I got a, um, a Blood Castle print that I need him to send me. Stat. Hurry up. Where is it? Anyway, we'll find out. Um, hopefully they didn't send in another package. I guess they rolled it up. That makes sense. I'll probably send it over tomorrow. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching. If you've seen this movie before, if you've seen any of the ones that I haven't seen, let me know. Uh, don't No spoilers here. We're going to enjoy this. Um, not in that way. We'll see you later on.